Glasgow's River Clyde, an international shipbuilding hub since the Industrial Revolution. Some of the most famous ships in the world were crafted here. Yet in the 1950s, ravaged by World War II and facing increasing competition, wide shipyards needed to adapt. In 1968, with the help of a Labour government loan, five Glasgow shipyards amalgamated to form the Upper Clyde Shipbuilders Consortium. But within three years, the consortium ran into financial trouble. I don't see any future for Upper Clyde shipbuilders as such. Uh, I've made that clear today. Recommendation, could we have a show of hands? Good eyebrows! There's no doubt that every single person who's worked in the shipyards uh, over the last 40 years uh, owes their, their, their job to uh, Jimmy Reid and his colleagues. The sun is almost set on shipbuilding in the Upper Clyde. I would like it to be revived. Maybe not to the scale of before, but to be revived. It's part of our heritage. It belongs to this river. <laughs> 